Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Gary's Mod, and today I'm going to be doing a uh, Brute Boris in the FNAF Freddy Fazbear's Pizza map. And uh, let's see what happens. I do want to see how this uh, awesome Dr. G base, Benny and the Ink Machine mod is going to work in this map and against other NPCs. Uh, shout out to Why Not Boy. And uh, yeah, 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 yeah. All right, I'm going to spawn in just one for now. And uh, yeah, I, we'll, we'll just see what happens. I'm going to spawn in 3D Freddy Fazbear because honestly, I think 3D Freddy Fazbear is a fan favorite amongst all of you. Uh, among us? Amongst? Amongst all of you. You guys tend to really like that. So let's see what happens with this epic interaction. And ready, set, go. Let's see what happens. Hopefully they don't kill me. Yeah, please don't kill me. I'm just a, oops, I'm just a bendy, okay? I'm just a stupid Bendy. By the way, dude, I played a little bit of Bendy in the Ink Machine uh, or Bendy in the Dark Revival last night. And honestly, pretty awesome. I played for an hour. It was great. I can't wait to play again. And um, yeah, I think I'm going to upload it tomorrow morning because I uploaded it and it did absolutely terrible, unfortunately. Whoa! Oh, 3D Freddy Fazbear, why did you do that to me? You broke all my bones. Actually, only broke my foot and it really hurt. Hold on. If I walk into this, will it hurt me? No. Okay. Oh, here we go. Here's the battle of the century. Oh. <laughs> Oopsies. Brute Boris got annihilated. Yo, that was not nice of you, sir. Okay. I want to see if he can compete with the other uh, characters. I think it's because his health is so low that he gets executed right away. But let, like I said, let's see how he just interacts with everybody else. Uh, I'm going to increase his health, though. So let's go to the health multiplier, increase it by a hundred and it still won't be enough. I think I have to increase it by like um, a million or something like that. If that's even possible. There we go. Now he has a lot of health. Okay. I'm going to spawn in a few of them so he can have some fun. Like I said, he's really slow, but when he charges, he's pretty fast and the ground. Oh, is this? Yo, I just discovered an infinite ground pound loop and it expands the universe like the Big Bang Theory unless they get stuck at the wall. Look at this. These guys are going to infinitely. Oh, he got stuck. OK, I guess I was proven wrong. Just kidding. Oh, my God. These guys are going to juggle each other forever. That is awesome. OK, let me move him. Hold on. <laughs> Dude, that's actually a cool little bug I found. Not a bug, but like a it's a what you call it. It's a feature. It's a feature. It's not a bug. It's a feature. Okay, so if you spawn in a bunch and if they launch and like, uh, like superhero land, they will launch each other. The ones that are not launched and then like, yeah, so on and so forth. Okay, so now that those guys are really tanky, let me let me change the health right here back to one because like I said, oops, that's eleven. All right, let's spawn in some Fazbear Ultimate Pill Packs here, and actually no, we'll spawn in some regular uh, Freddy 3D next spots. Whoa, hold on. Let me change his health though. Let's let's at least do like a point one because like I, it's just not fair, you guys. It's oh my god, wait, I can't do that. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, that's how low his health is? Alright, can I do a point zero one? You think that'll work? Let's see what happens here. No, that's zero HP. Alright, well, we have to do point one. And he has eighty five thousand HP. Alright, let's just spawn in one right here. And let's see how he, he, he fights against all of these guys. But like I said, this, this this NPC is very powerful. Oh, there we go. Now that's a battle I like to see. Okay, they're fighting. A lot of people are getting stuck in the roof. This is not going to go well. A lot of things are going to start launching. I'm going to ask why not, boy? Can you add? Can you add the feature that uh, Verona Vicious has added? Where okay, like if I go into Ragdoll mode and he just walks into me, he kicks me like crazy. Is there any way like? Can Verona Vicious and and, and 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 Why Not Boy, can you guys like work together? Because I know all the Verona Vicious packs have that. And well, this is not made by Verona Vicious. This is made by uh, Jolius's buddy. I forgot his name. I'm so sorry. Uh, I know it's on my it's on my front page because I, I did add him. Let me see. It's uh, El 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 Elias Bravo. But anyways, I just like it for the video's sake, and I think it's really awesome to have. Wait, is he going after me? Yo. He was. I just like how like I could just get ragdolled. I think it's hilarious for videos. It's just a little feature. I don't know how much code it is to, to add that, but it would be pretty dope. 
this fight is gonna happen forever and that's just because of how the differences of the mods i like i love npc battles it's one of my favorite things um all right yeah th this fight's gonna last so long i, I do want to see how i'm gonna just go on this side and let's see how the fazbear ultimate pill pack interacts with all these guys let's just have a regular freddy fazbear here and we'll see what happens brute boris prepare for battle oh is he gonna infinitely just scream at you yeah okay we're not gonna have that that's not even fair he's down oh wait i don't think none of them are gonna take any damage to be honest let me increase the damage that, that that's gonna be awesome all right here we go let's see what happens here the, the problem with the both of these guys is that they launch each other and gary's mod is like i don't know i think that oh dang he went for the superhero punch okay this is dope this fight th these guys need to fight outside they can't fight inside though because they launch so much these guys should be in tekken with the amount of launching they do i think the launches are a bit excessive like the distance too i i think if they launched each other like like about that much is like fine but it needs to be like tekken where you can you can chain the combos now now that would be cool that would actually be cool oop i broke my legs but yeah here, let, let me try to like share an example okay so i i don't know what it does but i think it has like the same properties of like interacting yo he jump scared me how did he do that oh oh that's why i turn off uh thinking hold on hold on hold on hold on. anyways um let me, let me try this really quick hold on hold on hold on. how am i gonna do this let me just do this oh dude brute boris sounds so cool as well ah i broke my bones oh yeah by the way i will be playing benny in the dark revival again but i'm gonna upload in the morning because i uploaded so late last night and the video just did not do well and you i know you guys wanted the video out i did too but dude it took so long to upload that youtube kind of sucks with that dude really oh my god 3d freddy fazbear what are you doing has he destroyed one yet i don't think so i i think i think they, they don't take damage unless they're in the down state i think i might be wrong with that but let's see let's, i'm gonna try this weapon yeah look at that invulnerable i think he has to be in the down state so <laughs> you look how much health he has he has like six million health i think so he has to go in the down state six million times times a hundred but I just want to see like how much destructive power or force can they exceed. Just for the sake of the video, let's have a bunch of battles right now. Let's have a Goku Drip. No, I'm just going to have a bunch of 3D Freddies because, like I said, it's a fan favorite. Oh, let me just get rid of a few. That's kind of too many. This is the, the, the battle of the launching powers. Look at this guy. He's just like, boom, boom, boom. I can't, you can't even exist right here. If you exist right here, you will be infinitely launched. Oh, yeah. Look at these guys. This guy, this is the launch party right here because he's ground slamming and then he's getting launched and he's landing. I'm going to see what happens if I put a Freddy Fazbear right there. Oh God. Yo. The amount, hold on. Let me put it right here. Is he going to get stuck? Oh, he's dealing damage. Oh, look at that launch. Welcome to the launch party, ladies and gentlemen. It's like a bounce house. Welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Brute Boris's bounce house. Oh, he's stuck now. I I would love to see that like the more airtime they get, the bigger the the launch. That would be kind of cool too, but that that sounds very difficult to code. I don't even know how you would do that. That's that sounds very difficult. I, you'd have to like add some weird distance traveling thing. I don't know. I I love the way uh I, I love uh like i was doing a little bit of roblox stuff and, and, and like coding and stuff like that I, I find it fascinating i wish i could learn lua and all that stuff it's really cool it's really really cool what you can do and it, it makes me appreciate mods and and and, and games that are made more because it's like dude someone made this from like from nothing you know or <laughs> or as a lot of people that do coding it's like it's like oh yeah th thanks for uh thanks for letting me borrow that code it's like oh it's not even mine anyways <laughs> That happens a lot too, and, and and the community's pretty chill with that. I think, I don't know, unless it's like absolutely just copy paste. But if you, if it's if it's allowed and you could use it to to grow on it, then I think it's fine. I think I don't know. I've seen a meme like that. I might I'm probably entirely wrong with that, but I don't know. But this is really cool. Except everyone's stuck now. Dude, look at this door. How do how did this door get like this? 
It's like a keychain now. Oh man. Oh wait. Who's almost dead there? Is that is that Frodo? Or Freddy? I, his name is actually Frodo, but I call him just 3D Freddy Fazbear. I think it is. I'm gonna see one of them go down. Yes! The fit wait, the physics prop did 85,000 damage. That door, that keychain door hanging thing actually did 85,000 damage to him. That's redonkulous. But yeah, this is this is actually uh beautiful. A beautiful NPC battle. Uh-oh. These guys are in the down state. I really would like to see an interactable uh fighting pack with like some cool characters. It would be very difficult to create, but if, if it's possible, that'd be sick. That'd be so cool. I'm just really into fighting games. But more more importantly, Tekken. You know, are these guys really just gonna ground pound right there? They really are. Okay, well. Holy moly, there's a battle in the back alley here. This guy's ready to slam. Come on and slam! And welcome to the jam! Oh, these guys are gonna infinitely launch. It's actually really cool. I like this. I think it's pretty fun. Uh, I'm thinking of, of, of like a... What's a really good map to have these guys on? To have that. Because like if you can infinitely bounce, it's literally a bounce house. And I want to see what happens if I ragdoll. Like, I'm going to try to... I'm going to try to see where I can go. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Wait, it doesn't launch me. Okay, see, that's what I'm saying right there. Like, if I could launch as a ragdoll in a ragdoll state... Oh, dude, that would be awesome. I don't know if it's if it's too hard to, to code or too much to ask for. But I think, I think it would be really funny to have that, dude. I think it'd be really great content. I don't know. I I don't want to come across as like, uh, I want the mod like this. I want it like that. Uh, uh, I'm, I'm a poopy head. I'm, I'm just saying, I think it would be pretty funny. It'd be pretty cool. Cause like a lot of the videos I've done over the past few months have been like ragdoll related. And it's been, it's been so much, it's been so, so much fun. And uh, with the new dark revival released, I think it'd be pretty cool. Dude, man, I really wish I could play other games and they would get as many views as uh, other stuff. But like the YouTube algorithm, it's just so crap that if I do play something else, it's like, oh, this is not Gary's mod or Five Nights at Freddy's. Oh, here we go. See, if I could just get like infinitely just boom, 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 boom. <laughs> that'd be so funny. I know as a player, it definitely does the job. And then it, I could do that, which I mean, that works too. We could do a video about this, like boom, and then ah. A competition like which which Boris can launch the farthest or something like that. Oh god. Uh-oh. Dude, whoa! I got super launched there. Hold on. Okay, there we go. Um, but yeah, I don't know. What do you guys think so far about Benny and the Dark Revival? I think it's incredible. Um, hopefully we get a pack soon with that. I don't know how soon. I'm gonna be very, very patient with that. And um, yeah, Benny and the Ink Machine is actually one of my greatest uh subjects to cover on Gary's mod. Like usually the Benny the Ink Machine videos, they pop off massively. So I can't wait for this pack to be finished. Like I said, if it were to be added where it has interactions via ragdolls, even just walking into me like that, and I can get kicked, that would be epic, except he's stopping me. But yeah, if you could just walk into me, kick me, punch me, all that, I think it's hilarious. It's just funny content. I don't know. Ragdolling is just funny content. And then on top of that, everything else to be interactive, the punches, the, the the ground superhero slam, all that would be really dope. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and call it there. Let me know what you guys think on who wins. I think Freddy Fazbear wins this battle. Uh, but yeah, I just want to see a good NPC battle. Uh, let me know what you guys want to see in the next video. Click on the video on the left or the right, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay, bye-bye.